Hello friends and welcome to what is probably going to be the last episode here of the Double Masters Smooth Magic. We hope that you've enjoyed this product as much as I have. There may be one more video, but it's quite possible this will be the last. You know, with Zendikar Rising coming up real soon here, we're going to probably transition over to some of that. And we do hope that you stop in watch some of those videos as well you know leave us a comment say hey you know general let us know you're there uh let's go ahead and get started so that last box we have was probably the worst box we have pulled yet so fingers crossed that in the close here of the double masters videos we pull something extremely exciting again we're still looking for the doubling season still looking for that jace We've kind of hit everything else, and it's good to see. Uh, not a lot of meddling mages, which is extremely nice. Not a lot of Stoneforge mystics, which, you know, that's okay. But yeah, I've definitely seen folks get tons of meddling mages. We have been very lucky to dodge that bullet. Alright, coming up on our first rare of the uh, last couple boxes here. A Thespian Stage and a Brea Ethereum Shaper. Pretty cool. A Blood Moon for a fairly solid box topper and a Dark Confident. Again, it's a Mythic. I'm not really sure the value of that one. It's one of those that I haven't looked into. But as I've found, the majority of the Mythics here in Double Masters are worth uh, at least half the box in value so a good you know 40 to 50 dollars all right so a nice warm-up nice start to our last couple boxes here moving in for number two again we're looking for anywhere between two and three mythics really have a solid box opening here at uh, two or three of the showcase mythics that is the regular mythics well nice are just kind of a little bonus as far as i'm concerned the master splicer the invigorate and <laughs> pongify <laughs> love that one enlarge and here we go our first rare is the cyclonic lift Another Sword of Light and Shadow Mythic. Great, great pull. Love to see that. Cyrexian Metamorph. Don't like to see that one. And an uh, Atraxia. Or Atraxa, Praetor's Voice. Again, this is another one I haven't really looked at the value of. I'm not sure if that's an exciting pull or a lackluster one. But it is a Mythic. And I will take a Mythic. Uh, I was going to say over a rare any day, but it's not actually true. Sometimes those rares can hold more value than those mythics. So two mythics down. We are looking for number three here to make this a really great box opening, but two is always nice. And when you when you have to settle for one mythic, that's a that's a sad box time. Dig through those commons here. We got the treasure keeper, a little centaur type automaton, it almost looks like. Elsnia guild mage. Top of the statue. <laughs> Jor's for. You know, this Jor here reminds me of uh, the Clash of the Titans. There was a little bird there. Oh, I don't remember its name. Master Transmuter for number two. A fatal push for the upshifted common. And an Urza's power plant. Alright folks, again this is the last pack of quite possibly the last of the Double Masters product. I've enjoyed my time immensely with this and I hope you have too. 
as a reminder, we are not done here. We'll be moving very quickly on over to the uh, Zendikar Rising, which uh, should be out real soon here. We'll probably be taking a look at some of the collector's boosters there, maybe some of the setbacks, you know, a smorgasbord of, of um, product there to check out. So that should be fun. Rumors are there's going to be some fetch lands in the collector's boxes. So it'll be cool to see that, along with, uh, of course, those set packs here. We're going to have cards from uh, various different sets, old cards with old artwork. So those will be fun. I'm a huge fan of the old artwork and magic. One of the reasons I still play today. All right, we got the Cy Phyrexian Revoker. The Shamanic Revelation. Can't ever pronounce that one. The Thought Seas. And for the very last box topper, we have a Karn. That's a pretty solid end to our Double Masters. <laughs> that guy smiled though, right? Folks, thank you so much for hanging out with us on Smooth Magic, your chillest and most relaxing place for booster box openings on YouTube. We hope that you've enjoyed us, and as always, wishing you all to have a smooth day.